Hello everybody, Helen Chin Lu here from the Healing Place Energy School.com. I'm so excited about my online school. I have about 26 classes that you could take right now that will address and teach you in one detail, especially for those people who've been following me for the last 10 years on how to recognize your energy flow. And we've started off with a nine part chakra, knowing your chakra 101. And we're doing how to read and feel energy because now you know energy read, you need to know what to do when you sense energy. And there's a 60 minute foot relaxation protocol on there that to help someone to relax and de-stress. Meditation galore. I'm like pumping out all of these courses and I'm just amazed at what I have achieved. So right now, what I am putting together this week is a two part class series on how to take care of your hands. These poor hands and my poor, th even though I have thumbs of steel, they hurt. They're achy. So what I have done is going to teach you what to do to take care of your hands, especially if you have arthritis, carpal tunnel syndrome, or you're clicking too much. Click, 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 click. Swipe, swipe, swipe. You're over exerting your fingers. So I'm going to teach you how to strengthen your fingers and your hands, your wrists, and how to relax your hands. And I'm in this video, I am gonna show you how we're gonna end it off is with a hot wax hand bath. Doesn't that sound exciting? You dip in your hands of wax and you can feel the tension ease away from your hands. So let me show you this little demonstration. I'll talk to you soon. And once my class is up live, I'll let you know. So this is Helen Chin Lu from the Healing Place Energy School. Let's go over some of the guidelines for a hot wax hand bath. First of all, I'm gonna show you the machine, okay? And it looks like this. It's oval shape, and obviously it's a lid that comes off. I will show you with the lid off, but you know what? I'm holding the uh, container. And what you would do is put wax in. Let me show you what the wax looks like. It's a paraffin. I would say this is a one pound log. And since I like lavender, I just put it into the um, tub and let it sit. How long would this take to melt? I would say about an hour. You can buy pellets, which will melt much quicker. So that's something you could think about. And back to this container, you see in front, there are three controls. It's warm, hot, and very hot. So you gotta be careful. You could give us a setting that says melt. So if you put it on melt, you've got to watch it. And again, coming back to how long it will take to melt, maybe a couple of hours with the logs, maybe 60 minutes with the pellet. And you might be thinking, well, how hygienic is this, Helen? It's great if you do it only on yourself and you put your own hands in the wax. Obviously, take all your jewelry off, wash your hands really well. So here I am in front of my machine getting ready to dip. I'm going to test the wax because the key is not to burn yourself. So I'm touching it. It's pretty liquided. Let's see if it's a little bit melty on the bottom, but it looks like there's a solid mass on top. So I'm placing back on my box here and I'm going to just use do one hand because I need the other hand to insert my gloves. Usually I have somebody who will help me to do this. My husband's really good at this where he helps me with my gloves on. So I'm gonna dip, get my bag ready, dip, just to test it. It's nice and warm. I'm gonna do a single dip and hold it down for a second. Ooh, look at this. See how it's yucky? Now I'm gonna insert it into the plastic bag. Here we go. It's really quite warm. See, it's starting to solidify. So I'm gonna let it solidify just a little bit before I put on my oven mitt. So come back in 10 minutes and I'm gonna show you how to take this off. <gasps> there it is. There's the alarm. And I'm not gonna shut it off. Here we go, where's that alarm? Shut it off, okay, here we go. I'm gonna take off my glove, my mitt. This is pretty hard right now pretty hard and how do you take it off I'm gonna hold it on the bottom and I'm gonna push 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 all the way off Ta-da! I have one hot sweaty hand 
but it feels really good. I can feel it's really soft, really soft, a little sticky from the wax, but I can feel the blood moving. I want to show you what my bag looked like after I took the wax off my hands. Look, it's shaped like a glove. And now it's convenient. All I have to do is throw it away. What do you do with your hot bath machine? Put the lid back on and unplug it and store it away. And when you know you're going to do another hot bath, a wax bath, pull it out a couple hours before you need it and you're ready to go. So I hope this demonstration is going to be helpful to get you to try a hot wax hand bath. The machines, you could get it anywhere, on, um, just about anywhere. They're very reasonable for 30 bucks. You could be doing out of, I would say, one pound of wax, probably about 24 baths. So imagine if you went somewhere to have it done in, I would say, in about 40 bucks, you're getting 24 baths. So give this a try. It will help to ease pain uh, that's associated with arthritis, carpal tunnel. And if you're a reflexologist like I am, it's going to help me. So let me know what you think. Give us a drop off and I support at Healing Place Energy School. I would love to hear from you. I'll talk to you really soon. Bye-bye.